you guys saw the meme for these products, for the Micro Magic products. This is one of the most ridiculous, awesome sales I've ever seen Tupperware do. It's $105 worth of products for $34. You get all three of them for less than one of them. And here's another, here's another interesting fact, okay? When the new catalog comes out, and I'm pretty sure even the one we have, the breakfast maker is not in it. So you can't just buy the breakfast maker out of the catalog. The rice cooker's in there and the pasta maker's in there, but this is like a bonus round because you can't just buy it unless it's in a special offer somehow, or they just put it out there as one of the you know online exclusives. And then it's gonna be $35. So this is 35, this is 35, this is 35, this is 34. If you walked into any store or anything online and saw this, You'd buy it no matter what. And these are great gifts, you guys. So we're going to talk about all three of them real quick. The first thing I'm going to do is show you, this is really one of my favorite products, just as far as easy to use and it's so multifunctional, okay? Um, it comes with two little egg inserts that you can do poached eggs in. And all you have to do to do the poached eggs is add three tablespoons of water to the little insert, put an egg in there, put it, put the cover on it, put it in the microwave for like one and a half to two and a half minutes and you have poached eggs. Now, I'll make a lot of poached eggs. I do, however, love a good omelet, all right? So I did cut up some of the things for the omelets. All right, I got some bacon because where's eggs without bacon? And tomatoes and I have some green onions. I also love, there's, there's recipes for this for spinach and mushroom omelets. Just anything, anything that you would put in, if you're gonna put onions or green peppers, anything. So take three eggs and put them in your quick shake or just stir them up, it doesn't matter. And pour them in your breakfast maker, okay? Could not get simpler. And then just take your ingredients, whatever you want in your omelet. I'm gonna put some egg or some bacon in here. I'm gonna put some tomatoes, because I like tomatoes a lot. Some onions and of course because there is no such thing as eggs in the morning without cheese i'm gonna put some grated cheese in here now here's the other thing i want you to know it see these products over here i made macaroni and cheese and ethan's right super simple to make great college kid thing i made rice and i'm making these omelets this is everything i used right here okay the cheese grater um, the mix and store pitcher that goes right underneath the cheese grater. Two Benton serves with, or Benton serves, sorry, two modular mates with rice and pasta in it, a one cup measuring cup, a spatula, and a simple spoon. That's it. So, right now, we are going to put this in the microwave. You saw what was in there, okay? Just going to turn around and put it in here. Put it all in there. There you go. Three minutes and while that's cooking, we're going to talk about these other ones. So let me do this really quick. Of course, here we go. Nope. All right, three minutes. All right, while that's going, I want you to know we're going to talk about the rice maker for just a second, okay? Now, you can make any kind of rice in here. I don't care what kind of rice you're making. And if you Google, Google is my friend when it comes to recipes. If you Google Tupperware rice maker recipes, you're gonna get a whole book on what to make in here. You can do red beans and rice. You can do black beans and rice. You can do overnight steel cut oats in here, okay? And it's so simple. The rice itself, this has, it's got the clip top on it, okay? And it has a second top on it that keeps the, like whenever you do rice and you know how it boils over on the stove and it's all that white starchy stuff, this separates that from your rice, okay? So all you have to do in here, it's just like any, any other kind of rice. It's two to one, one cup of rice, any kind of rice, two cups of water, and it will make rice, okay? You can double it because you can make up to six cups of rice in here. It's great once you do it, all you do, you put it in the microwave with the rice and the water. You set your microwave for 10 minutes. 
you walk away and go do whatever else it is you're going to do. When it gets done, when you do that microwave go off, you let it set another five minutes, and then you have perfect rice every time, every time. And the other thing that happens is, okay, so Pam was talking about instant rice, and I looked it up this afternoon. You can get a box of instant rice for um, $3, honestly. And that $3 is going to get you 28 ounces of rice, which is about 14 servings. So that same three dollars, you can buy a three-pound bag of rice, and you're going to get a whole lot more out of it than that. And it's super simple. Even if you get the minute rice, you still have to boil the water and put the rice in there. This, you just put it in the microwave and walk away. And those steel cut oats, super simple. Okay. And then whenever you get done, you can also put this in the refrigerator. All right. You can serve out of here. You put this in the refrigerator. You can reheat your rice in there. Just put a little bit of water in there with it, put it back in the microwave, and you're good to go. All right, so $35, or if you buy the set, just a little over $11. Pretty good deal on that one. Now, Ethan's pasta maker. <laughs> and he was so right about so many things with this. I made the mac and cheese. Didn't have elbow macaroni, but you can use any kind of pasta in here. And then, um, so see, this was 10 minutes total. All right, I did the pasta for eight minutes, drained the water, and all you have to do to drain the water, he showed you, there's a part on this, and there's a big arrow here so that you don't get confused. You do not put this lid on to do your microwave on the pasta. You leave the lid off, just like you would, it's kind of like a mental thing. If you're going to boil pasta on the stove, you're not gonna put a lid on it. It's gonna make a mess. So if you put it in the microwave, you're not gonna put a lid on it. When it comes out and you, your eight minutes are up, you've got the hot water in there, you just take it over to the sink and you pour it out. Put the lid on it and just pour it out. Now, some of the other things you need to know about all three of these products is the instructions are in the product, okay? The inside the pasta maker, it shows you two, four, and six servings. How much pasta to go in there and how much water goes in it. Then you're gonna put this over here. Also can go in the refrigerator and be reheated later, okay? The rice maker, all the directions are on inside and on the top of this, okay? It tells you how to do it. So there's nobody has to lose a little book. There isn't any of that going on. It's all right here. Now, our eggs are done. So we're gonna get those out. And the breakfast maker, it's so simple, you really don't need any kind of instruction book for it. So I'm going to grab it. And there's little handles on the side, just like on the pasta maker, there's handles on the side. So you can grab it out of there and you're ready to go. Now, when you take this off, all right, you've got this omelet and it's absolutely delicious. Add a little salt and pepper if you want to, put some more cheese on the top because that's a great thing. The other thing about this breakfast maker, and I'm going to tell you, my oldest daughter um, had three children that were teenagers all at the same time. And so they all had to get out the door and get to school in the morning. She was working, so everybody had to go. And they each had their own breakfast maker. And they would make their stuff the night before. If they were going to have eggs or an omelet, they would put everything in there, stick it in their refrigerator. If they were going to make, you can make French toast in here, you can make pancakes, um, you can make just regular scrambled eggs, the poached eggs we talked about, okay? They would make, they would set everything up the night before and put it in the refrigerator. And when they got up in the morning, they'd come out to the kitchen one at a time, put their breakfast in the microwave for three minutes, run back and do whatever teenage kids do to get ready. One of them is a boy, so not much, and the other two would do all the things and come back out, grab their breakfast, and they could even eat it in the car if they were running late, which she said happened more than it needed to. But, you know, it was great because she didn't have to worry about fixing breakfast every morning. They had a good hot breakfast every morning and they could make what they wanted to. Now, this is also awesome for, you can make a cookie, you can make cookies in here, you can make a, like a single serve cake in here, um, cinnamon rolls, the canned cinnamon rolls. You can put three cinnamon rolls in here and put it in the microwave for a minute, and they are delicious. And who doesn't like cinnamon rolls? Okay, that's a perfect 
not so healthy snack, but <laughs> it's still a perfect snack, okay? Um, and it's also great for like single serve or maybe two servings of steamed vegetables. So you've got breakfast and snack and vegetables, okay? You've got any kind of pasta that you wanna make, spaghetti, macaroni, this lasagna noodles fit in here. You can do those in here, any kind of pasta. And you can mix things in here, okay? We made the macaroni and cheese right in here. You can make, um, if you're doing noodles, you can do two noodle casserole and put it in here. You can serve it out of here. And I, I laugh whenever Ethan says sometimes he eats it right out of there because, yep, I'm, I'm sure that that's going to happen. And then the rice maker, any kind of rice, if you make a lot of rice, you can save it and put it in your refrigerator or you can put it into individual portions and like microwave cereal bowls, put it in your refrigerator and save it and the steel cut oats. So one more time, because we need to know this, $35 a piece, $105 or $34 for all three, it's $11 a piece, $11.50 maybe, and they make great gifts, okay? If you're gonna give somebody a pasta maker and you put maybe some spaghetti in here, um, maybe a couple packs of macaroni and cheese, okay? If it's a college kid and, and just a simple spoon that they can do it with, okay? If you're gonna make the rice maker and you know that somebody loves so overnight steel cut oats, you put steel cut oats in here, or you, I mean, you can get the oats to put in here, maybe, you know, something to stir them up with couple of bowls so that they can divvy it up once they have it, all right? And this, this you could wrap up in a bag with a bow with some chocolate chip cookie mix or, you know, like a cake mix. You could do anything in here, okay? And they make great gifts and they're very, very practical. They're lightweight and very easy to store. Okay, you can store this down inside here. So. That's something to think about for the next week. This is on the website. Like Pam said, they have 50% left of what they started out with. So now's the time to get those orders in and just see how much you can make. And if you have one of these, go live. Go live and do a video or do a video and put it out there. It's super simple to do and you really can't mess it up, okay? All right, guys, so make it happen. I'm gonna go eat my eggs.